So we've got the mount. Oh, I wish these were hooked up. Look at the sun shining on these panels. The electrician, he stopped by. And good thing he did. Canada has so many rules. I don't know if it's just us, but you cannot have these exposed. So now we have to cover those. So pull the wires back up, probably, and Bob will have to box these in somehow, but I'm glad this electrician stops in and tells us these things because you don't know what your local, um, like here, I think it's Ontario standards are. So now we have to box in the back. An electrician says it's funny because like these are completely covered. There's nothing that you can do with them. Well, I guess a kid could pry that off and maybe lick it. I'm not sure, but for safety sakes, we will get that done. And hopefully uh, the electrician can come and he's going to move all this stuff and uh, he's ordered the wire and because of you know that c word everything is back ordered and whatever and he's just going to bury the wire to the little hut back there and hopefully now once they're um, all hooked together we'll have enough solar panels to charge all those batteries completely and I don't have to listen to that alarm at five o'clock in the morning saying that my batteries are dead. Anywho, love you all. Bye. Okay, so I forgot to show you the front panels that he completely finished now, except for covering up the wiring on the back of them. And there's the little battery room or solar room, whatever we're gonna call it. That's where the batteries, the inverter, the chargers, fuses, oh, all that kind of good stuff. It's gonna be in that little hut.